Photoshop is a image editing software used to advertisements creation, wall poster designing, web applications, jewelry designs creation, fashion designing, animations, 3D effects, software development, album making, photo modifications, wall poster designing, flex banners creation, cover pages, newspaper photos, magazine photos and other creations. Ok, first click the button start, select all programs and uh, add up Photoshop master collections CS6. Select this Photoshop application to display the Photoshop screen or interfaces. First one is the menu bar. The menu bar contains application name ps means photoshop next one is the menu bar, uh, file menu it contains new open close save save as import export automatic and other options edit menu contains undo redo cut copy paste and other options uh, means just define brush define custom shape and uh, other modification options next one is the image to display the different types of image adjustments, image canvas size and image size, duplicate image and other options. Next one is the layer menu. It contains different types of layers and layer related options. Next one is the type menu. Means to display the different types of text related options. Next one is the selection menu. It contains different types of selections and the selection related options. Filters, it contains different types of photo modifications and background designs and filter effects. 3D menu contains different types of 3D effects and 3D related options. View means general view options. Window menu contains different types of windows. Next one is the property bar. Property bar contains selected properties, selected tool properties or object properties. Ok, select this window menu and select choose options means show or hide the options window. Select this uh, tool options. Toolbox contains different types of creating, editing and display tools. Select this window menu and select option tools show or hide toolbox. Click on top of the toolbox, minimize or maximize the toolbox, right click on any tool to display the flyout window and the left mouse button click is also select a tool, uh, select this tool and to display the, choose the property options on property bar to display the two colors, one is the foreground color, second one is the background color, uh, press X button to change foreground to background and background to foreground. D is also default foreground and background colors. Okay, double click on foreground color to display the color picker window. Select any color. Click OK automatically to display the color on foreground or background. Okay, next one is the layer palette. Layers contains different types of layers and layer commands. Shortcut key is F7. Show or hide the layer palette. Okay, layer palette contains different types of layer related options. Layer means a part of the design. Control shift and is also create a new layer. Delete button is also just delete a layer. Okay, just press 1 to 0 opacity percentages. First insert a photograph or design object then select this uh, opacity then select this image layer or object layer press 1 is also to display the 10 percent opacity 2 is also 20 percent 3 is also 30 percent 4 40 percent 5 50 percent 6 60 percent 7 70 percent 8 80 percent 9 90 percent 0 0 100 percent okay select this background layer and fill any color Again select this image layer and change this blend mode. Blend mode means just to display the different types of modes. Means image display modes. Select this darker color to display the dark color. Multiply. 
and color burn linear burn select any type of color to display the selected color on image okay next one is the colors shortcut key is f6 show or hide the color window the color window contains basic colors one is the red second one is the green and third one is the blue rgb colors change this red color automatically to change the foreground color change this green color to change the green color click on background color then again change this colors automatically to change the foreground or background colors on bottom of the toolbox okay press tab key show or hide the entire windows ff is also full screen mode press two times f automatically to display the full screen mode press ctrl r show or hide the document ruler the ruler contains document measurements and horizontal and vertical guidelines okay just click and drag on ruler automatically to display the different types of guidelines okay these are the interfaces